With regards to mental health risks and hazards within your business, a main factor is around support. What support do your team feel that they have? And this is both emotionally, internally and externally. And it's not just a matter of whether they feel supported at home. It's whether they feel supported at work. And there's a lot of different moving facets within that. But identifying and really understanding what support means to your team, because support is individual. What you feel is support is going to be different to the next person. And what you need right now is also going to be different to the next person. So I encourage you, really find out what support your team need and support them in a way that's conducive to them and also to the business. And then what you can do is you can test and measure to see whether they're actually getting what they want from the support or whether it needs to be tweaked a little bit. When your team feels supported, they can deal with the pressures of work. They can deal with an influx in workload because they have other supporting factors around them, such as support. And when we're looking at mentally healthy workplaces, it's not just a fruit bowl in the kitchen or yoga at lunchtime. That's not going to help the people that are in and amongst it and feeling the pressure of it. But there are things that you can do as an organization to help improve the mental health of your team. If you want to know more, feel free to reach out. But why don't you ask your team and how they want to be supported and see what you can do to improve that for them. Until the next video, take care.